Hello everyone, it's DA here. Hope you guys are doing great. Hope you are doing amazing. So ever since Massive officially announced the appearance mods or the transmog system in Division 2, the question most of the player base have been asking was, who asked for this feature? You will be surprised because I went through some digging so you don't have to, and to my own surprise as well, some people actually asked for this, and I'm talking about post and requests from four years ago. The first one was found from a post from 2016 where a Reddit user specifically asked for appearance mods or character mods, and I read, we need more character appearance mods. Everyone looks the same out here in the DZ. Would be nice to be able to manipulate individual facial features, glasses, etc. I'd personally love some mask and goggles. A hockey mask would rock. Any chance of this? Am I the only one thinking the character customization is really lacking for a triple A title? Now, as you can see right here, some of the things being requested here may sound basic to you now, but they weren't part of the Division 1 game. And as you can also tell, a lot of those appearance features are now part of the stable in Division 2. Now, let's move on to the other request. Last year, 2019, another Reddit user requested Transmog and explained what they meant. The user even referenced Diablo 3's appearance system, which basically is in tune with what the developers are talking about today. Another forum post from 2019 shows a user asking for Transmog again, saying this is something Division 1 was lacking and even pointed out that it was a requested feature from Division 1. Back to Reddit, another user last year 2019 requested an Odyssey style of transmog system for Division 2, telling Massive it would be an awesome move if they do this in the game. So while I do not agree that they should be focusing on cosmetics, I also see a handful of individuals that might have been part of the motivation factor for this new appearance system. Now of course Massive went full force with this one instead of them focusing on other aspects of the game. Now for a lot of this post is only let's say about 100 people in total that upvoted or commented or said yes to some of these things. Uh, some posts probably went under the radar and got deleted, but I don't think that percentage compared to the large scale percentage of the Division 2's player base would want this instead of other forms of content. Anyways, let me know what you guys think about this down below in the comment section. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.